On to college football after 11 games and without a conference to call home, the independent Old Dominion football team wraps up its season Saturday among the pine trees of the University of North Carolina. Because this is a transition year, meaning that they are moving up to Conference USA, the Monarchs are ineligible for any type of postseason play. No playoffs. No bowl games. So what do they do? Well, with eight games under the belts all season long, they have considered their game coming up against the Tar Heels to be their bowl game, a chance to make national headlines against an ACC team with a long football tradition. Old Dominion did not fare well against its two previous ACC opponents, getting blown out at Maryland while losing by 11 at Pittsburgh last month. Star quarterback Taylor Heineke has had another sensational year, throwing for almost 4,000 yards and 32 touchdowns, but realizes he will face a bigger challenge against the Carolina defense. It's a different speed in the ACC, and um, you know, they, they play kind of similar to Maryland um, with what they do. Um, but again, we, we think we can move the ball against them. We think we can score points against them, but it's just going to be up to execution. After a 1-5 start, Carolina won at Pittsburgh last weekend and have won four games in a row still in the hunt for the Coastal Division Championship. The Heels are not about to underestimate Heineke and the Monarchs. The last time we probably didn't respect an opponent, we, we got embarrassed. And so, you know, it's, uh, uh, I don't think that that's going to happen. Uh, I think all you got to do is turn on that film. And uh, I don't know how many points they're averaging. What is it? It's got to be over 40. I mean, maybe close to 50. I mean, they're, they're scoring points on everybody. North Carolina is a 17-point favorite. And for more on the game, join Coach Bobby Wilder and me Friday night at 1045 for the Old Dominion Football Show.